Today, 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 we're on an adventure. And that adventure is getting a new toy chest. This bad boy here has gotten a lot of use. Ouch. That actually really hurt. This is, see, it's, it's rejecting its new, uh, new rival that's gonna be coming onto the scene. I got some spray paint on it. The hinges, oh. The hinges, uh, one of them busted off. This one's coming off currently. This thing's detached. This thing is detached. I mean, the handles, the handles are really just, the handles are really. Ah! All right, the handles are pretty good, actually. <laughs> handles are cracking. Right. Were you almost there? I know, it was the bottom of the thing was getting oh, out. Okay. You know, the bottom of the chest, the thing that holds things. Yeah, that's piece of Anyway, this thing is going to be retired and I will retire it in a fashion that involves an axe, of course, just to make sure that it has a good burial. So, we're gonna go out and find a new chest. I'm fairly certain that with the knowledge and, uh, and experience... <laughs> ready for this, Dan? Yep. Ready to go find some antique stores? Toy chests. Toy chest, toy chest! <laughs> oh, yeah, the bottom, bottom is pretty... Uh... Garbage. Yeah, see, it just caved in right there. Man, it just makes me mad every time I think about it. What? Give your daily thanks. Oh, oh yeah. Hey, Jataya! Hey, Jataya! The spirit elf, uh, spirit elf Bethsheba or whatever the name. Yeah, Bethsheba. Have fun. Steph is very friendly. She likes you a lot. She likes you a lot. You guys should leave. I'm Jordan Matthewson, and this is my journey to find the next great toy chest. Always look both ways before you cross the street. Expert tip number one. Ooh, expert tips are gonna be going. Can't wait for more expert tips. <sighs> okay, so my main plan here is to visit an antique mall. Now, I was here about three months ago at this antique mall because I needed to buy a model ship for our Lenovo uh, ah, yes. brand video. The SS Meow. The SS Meow. So I was scouring that place I saw a lot of cool ships, but they were like six or seven hundred dollars because they're really Oof. cool model ships. And there were a ton of chests. I just remember seeing chest after chest. I do remember you chests. texting. You were texting a bunch of candidates for the boat, and you were also like, "Man, if I ever need a new toy chest, this is where I'm gonna go." Yep. So that is the plan. All we have to do is shoot down Broadway for a little bit, and we will. Be we just there. have to shoot down Broadway. Just shoot up Broadway. We on Broadway? Yeah. Oh, we're on the Green Mile. We, we should, should stop. stop we should stop at Patience. Choice. Yes. That's my place. And I wanted to get an eighth anyway. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just stock the toy chest up. The toy chest. <laughs> toy chest will be full of bud. We'll have we'll have a false panel at the bottom <laughs> and it'll pop out. And that's where the stash is. It holds toys, but it also holds something a lot more enjoyable. <laughs> a lot Hashtag more enjoyable. Colorado. <laughs> Are you comparing drugs to toys? Mm. You're saying drugs are herbal a lot more remedy is how I like a lot more enjoyable it. than herbal remedy. Some money left there. Can what is that? I can't see. I can't tell. It says st. What's that? St Stella? No, that's not a Stella. Stella would be green. What is that? What is that? Somebody left their perfectly good booze over there. What a bunch of assholes. But if they left it there full, it's a gift for the next person to come along. <laughs> yeah. The toy box! That Wait. place is named the toy box! Where is it? Where? Where? Right there, oh, the, the toy, toy box. box! It's the name of that pet <laughs> store over there. That guy's picking a wedgie. Man, we're seeing a bunch That's... of miracles right now. Yeah, oh, is... antiques! Oh wait, there it is right there! It's there right it is there. right I there! Was, I, I was, you were right! Hold what? on, Dan, hold you, on. You almost hit that lady on the park, <gasps> park bench there. Yes! I knew it was here! Sweet! I knew it was here. Oh, oh man, nobody's, nobody's open. The nobody's the, open. These are what you call mob fronts. No, these are the actual people who open their own businesses and mob are trying to... Mob fronts. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna dispute... Uh, that e-cig place is definitely a mob front. <laughs> um, <laughs> just e-cig is all that it's... It's just says e-cig. So I, I'd say, okay, 50% mob fronts. Look at second. those shady characters going in there right now. <laughs> those guys in sweater vests with glasses on walking very politely towards the well, Mexican look at restaurant. They dually. They have a Silverado dually. Mob. <laughs> Drug cartel. They are very well to do looking. Yes, they are. This thing is. Man, that's a classic one. That's an old trunk. Is this, do the mechanisms still work? Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, that still works. Okay, well, that's, let's put that one in the running because that thing is. I mean, it's more of a trunk than a yeah. chest, but. Back right corner. Oh, no, that works. Oh, oh, right there. 
pals Ooh. that one, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> this one's even more. This one's a trunk. That's you know, that's a chest. Yeah, it's a trunk right there. Three hundred forty camelback, camelback trunk. Is what it's called. Yeah, there's no way this that's isn't a way, trunk. It's way too big. It looks like uh, Jason Statham a little bit. He's got a chicken too. It's Bill, the retired California stunt dummy turned cowboy. Five hundred bucks, but he's a stunt dummy. Joint. He looks pretty <laughs> stunt dummy-ish. We have the chest. Um, it's behind us, and it's very chesty looking. Yeah, it's uh, more so con considered a trunk. Yeah, it's pretty big. My understanding. The the toy trunk. Oh, that thing's amazing. Look at so, that. It's, it has it's an like old. an aluminium plated. That's awesome. George. Trunk. Yeah. Hopefully, not breaking anything of Stephanie's right now. Mother. It's quite big. Oh. We can actually put it in the, the room over. Let's just clear some room. Oh, it actually has locks too. Yep. All right, so the top the top is messed up. We're gonna have to undo that. Yeah. Woo! But pull it this out. This is awesome. Pull out the drawer. We're gonna have to, we'll have to rip out some of the. This is some Elizabeth. Man. Yes, it is. This is amazing. Or? Where's Spencer, guys? Oi! Hey. Oh, Gryffindor! <laughs> oh, it's gonna be perfect. Yeah, it looks it looks really close. Yeah. That's perfect. Ah, diggity. So we can keep it in here under the table, the podcast table. Spencer, can you grab uh, this one sledgehammer and one axe, please? So I can ask me a question. Okay, Dan, what do you think is gonna happen? I, th I think you're gonna hit it and it's gonna break. You think the whole thing's just gonna just crumble or is it more so just Oh, I think there are gonna be pieces, crack. maybe. I mean, if you're gonna go top down like this, yeah, I figured, you're gonna go. Well, if I, because this is going to be the most structurally supported piece right here. Okay, toy chest destruction. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. You split it right down the middle. Crap. Oh, it looks like real wood. I mean, we got... It's actually pieced together. These were planks on yeah, the front. You can, see. you can see where the, the bolts are in there. Goodness. Okay, well, I'm going to try and give it another whack right here. Give it a good whack, Jordan. Whack it off. <laughs> oh, the toy chest! Oh man, look at it go! <laughs> oh, crap! This that served thing's you splintered like crazy. This is dry this wood. This served you very well over the years, and you have just—you've had this for years. Yep, and years look what Jordan. happened to it. That was pretty good. I saw a piece of, there's a splinter that went over here. Goodness, okay, well, <laughs> that's good. I mean, we got it down to pretty much nothing at this point. Hey, you, you put this on the wall. Got some new reclaimed wood. How do you feel standing triumphant on top of your shattered? I mean, it's, it's good, it's a good feeling, knowing that I finally put this thing out of its misery, because that was, that thing was in rough shape. Oh well. And then back up a little bit. Yeah, back up, because I'm gonna go really good. You didn't even lodge it in there. You just hit the, the like. Well, it's, there's piece. nothing to lodge. I was thinking it was gonna go straight down, just go and split it. Well, still one more side. We can do that. <laughs> you better go quick. <laughs> there you go. There you go. There it was. My goodness. What a pile of rubble. Well, that's the toy chest for you. I guess I'll collect it and put it in the trash. Oh no! I have a screw in my foot. <laughs> Jordan, I have a screw in my foot. I felt it in my foot. <laughs> I felt that. Oh, don't worry. It's just a rusty nail. Oh, okay. How long was that? <laughs> oh, it was actually pretty long. Oh my goodness. I felt it on my foot and I was like, oh dang, I just think I just stepped on something. <laughs> well, that's it. I mean, the toy chest is no more, but we have our new toy chest. We just got to do a little bit of fix it up work on that thing. And that thing will be good to go. And then, I mean, from there, more toys. <laughs> I, I wanted to implement a brand new rating system as well that I think we're going to have some fun with. And basically, any toy that gets a three stars or above, uh, we're going to be taking careful care not to destroy it at all so that we can donate it. It's good. It'll serve someone else a lot better than just sitting somewhere in the house. If it's two stars or below and we don't want anyone to, you know, unfortunately fall victim to that horrible toy, it's going to get destroyed. And we'll think of various ways to do that. So that should be fun. New rating system, making sure that we're keeping it, uh, keeping these toys honest, because we don't want people to end up with crappy toys. Okay. That would be horrible. That would be horrible. That would be horrible. I'm all about fair toyage. 
in the U U.S. of A. The Fair Toyage Act. That's the thing, right? Yeah. Well, let's clean this bad boy up, and then we'll I'm gonna eat some lunch.